Okay, you all see that it is on off, right? At the zero, it's on off. 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 It's on off, right? And what is going on? Are you going to have like you don't want to come on now? Don't be laughing. That ain't funny. There you go. You see that? Off. You're going to hear it in a second. The windshield wipers are doing its own. You heard that? The windshield wipers are doing its own thing. Okay, it's on off, and the windshield wipers are not going. It's on off. And we hear nothing. It's not going. Turn it on. There we go. Oh, that's the same gear. Turn it off. Turn it on, off, and it's good. So, we're thankful. Big Blue, act right. All right, off to the next. Hey everyone, we are back at the trailer. We had some little cleaning to do, and that cleaning is Okay, we are cleaning the top of this, the warmer, and Chef is gonna clean the grill, and I'm just gonna rearrange a little bit of stuff, cause you know, we I need to have my, um, everything, you know, good. And I guess I'll, maybe I'll raise the board, I don't know, I'll see.
Hello, time to, time for the cleaning again. Reclean. Mm -hmm. Keep it clean, no problem. Okay, so we are done in here, and now it's time to go to the grill. So, let's go. Time to clean out the grill. Smokehouse is clean. That's some more charcoal. Oh, yeah. this, this is our board with our menu. It's out of our warmer. It's nice and clean. Clean the top of the warmer, nice and clean. I did some little, hopefully they do good, you know, we'll see, these are straws. And, you know, it's stacked up, it works real nice. You know, we just keep these here until it's time to stop bucket with our apron. And then our hand sink and all that good stuff. So everything is nice and clean and ready for the week. Everything was already clean. Okay, like I was saying, everything was already clean in the trailer. We just had to, um, I, you know, things that you not thinking of, you know, whenever you clean it, like the top of the warmer. Um, I had to get that um, clean and everything. And then I wanted to straighten up the things, you know, the cups and everything. It just was, the laying down just was looking a little, you know, didn't look as neat as I wanted it to look. What's going on? An old one? Huh? I can't hear you. Yeah. So, um, Chef is cleaning up the, the grill. Um, <clears throat> we were just trying to get some finishing touches up on, you know, some things in here, you know, before we, you know, start back on our work week. It is, um, what I can say, this is, it is definitely um, some work, any business anything you do anything that you care about passionately you gonna want it to look good you want it to you know because it represents us as a couple a married couple you know out here with our business um and then whenever it's time for you to have an inspection like we're supposed to have another inspection whenever it's time to have an inspection you don't have to you don't have to be straight oh my gosh you have to do this do this Everything is there, everything is clean, and we don't want to have any um, issues. We haven't had any issues with cleanliness in our trailer um, as far as us having um, our inspections. You want to make sure all your um, 
things are clean. They check the floors because they wanna make sure that you're working in a safe environment and the floors aren't slippery or you're, you know, it's gonna be a um, hazard to you. They um, check the cabinets, they check under our cabinets. I make sure, you know, everything is in order. I don't have any food under um, the cabinets because under the cabinets, I have the napkins under there, but they're um, sealed in there. Once they're open, I put them in over here under the um, table. What? You know what I'm talking about, where I keep the tea? I keep it under there so it don't absorb the smell or anything from any of our cleaning products or whatever. So only thing is under here is the holes, the long wire that plugs up the generator, our cleaning supplies, and our napkins. Um, oh, there's our paper towel and all the other stuff, the markers and the whiteboard eraser and all that stuff that we do, trash bags that we use because we change our trash bags, of course, daily. We don't have any issues with that. And um, some other things that Charles grill with, the, the grilling, um, whatever he used to grill with or whatever is under there. And we used to keep the charcoal under there, but what, the charcoal goes on the back. What up? You finished? Okay, let's go get a look at, he's finished with the, the um, grill. Let's go take a look. And this is the after. Nice. Okay. The smokehouse is ready for another grill. He does such a great job with cleaning the grill. That's his thing. And it looks very beautiful. Um, what else? And my bucket is right here. My bucket is clean. Don't think, oh gosh, she has a bucket on the sink where um, the, you know, the dishes and stuff go. I wash that bucket on a daily. It um, sits over here whenever we're working it is a clean bucket so calmness 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 okay because i never had a question she got a bucket back there huh? see it has our aprons in it and we keep them there you know for us when it's time for us to work and you don't think oh my gosh i left my apron at home they're always here once you know i wash them and everything i put them in the truck so my husband can bring them here when he comes here after you know we do our job for um, the week. Uh, as I was saying, I was talking about underneath there, so that, you know, is done. Then we have our refrigerator. You know, our refrigerator is here and everything. Um, we don't turn it on until we, like a day before, we're getting ready to work and everything. And we have, you know, the food in here that we do. Um, I think the only thing that we have in here that is done um the day before is getting the ribs and stuff seasoned because my husband like to have them overnight you know have them have that you know marinate overnight so and they're cleaned and wrapped and everything we put those in here we have those in here um and sometimes our potatoes for our potato salad We'll get those, you know, in here and have them um, ready to put our potato salad in there, have them ready to go for the next day. And then we have over, I already talked about under there, then over on top, you know, we have all of our cups and our bags our seasoning that's closed and sealed tight remember my pepper i showed you i put a top thing over that because you know i don't want anything to get in it you know ants or nothing like that so i don't want to attract any ants here because i don't have time for you know all that and you know the lids for our cups our cups for our tea for our sides and you know our bottles for our 
um, barbecue sauce. Remember we have the small ones and then I got the bigger ones cause they work better. And let me tell you something else that I did. Something else that I did. Let's see if I could get this out. So we have, uh, we have this big bottle of detergent and it doesn't have a spout to put the detergent in. So what I did was, let me show y'all. I put it in one of these. This is the thing that we, we have two of the, we have like six of them. Two of them are holding barbecue sauce right now. We have three more up there. And I use this for our dish detergent. Wasn't that a bad idea? You know, cause it, it you know, I don't have to pour out more than I need. So that was a good um, idea for, um, to use our, um, a good idea to use. <clears throat> so, yes, and we keep a Bible in here. You can always, you know, look at the Bible on the internet. That is not an issue, but we just like to have the word close by. So that is pretty much it, you know, wipe down and it's always good to not get in the point of not um, keeping your business clean. And, you know, you don't want your business being in the paper saying you were closed down because of some, you know, uncleanly things, you know, everyone. No, you straight. I already got a video of it, right? Yeah, Okay. So he's um, closing the back up and we are done with Big Red for the day. And hope y'all enjoy, enjoyed our semi-clean. Um, we do a deep clean we do a deep clean once a month and a semi-clean in the middle. Always, we always, we didn't always record, but you know, some people probably want to see and we wanted to share. So this is our semi-clean halfway through um, the month, what we do. Um, that's when I clean the top of the warmer um, for our semi-clean and the deep clean. And because you know, we have um, fumes and dust and we have the air conditioning unit we do clean that filter you know to make sure that stays clean and the air is flowing good and clean out windows and stuff every day because we don't want fingerprints and all that on the um, window and everything so and that's how we do and we go from there mm -mm -mm. I wouldn't because we're not going out right now so that's fine so this here ends our um, vlog. I showed you, um, I, what do you say? Mm -mm. Not really. I showed you all um, Big Blue. Big Blue had to had be wanted some attention. <laughs> Big Blue needed some attention. The signal would not turn off. I mean, we had it on off, but it still was in slow motion and that can be aggravating and had to take care of that. Thank goodness for warranties. And um, it's something else that we're doing to Big Red and that will be in the next vlog. Um, so I guess I could say to be continued if I don't decide to put it on the end of this, but we'll see. So thank you all for stopping by. As always, continue to be blessed. And if it's for any reason you are feeling bad, we pray that God gives you the strength to endure and to continue on. Most importantly, stay safe, love others. Um, we, you know, 
know there's a lot of things going on in the world and we just want you know you and your family and friends and everyone to stay continue to be safe in you know these troubled times we're in so i thank you all for stopping by and until next time if it's the lord's will we'll see you blessings Okay, we went to the store to buy a few things and we're gonna eat a little different and we'll see how that goes. We bought some pineapples, some halo oranges. We um, bought some green beans. Haven't had these time. I, that's back in the day whenever we used to go South Carolina for the summer and my grandma used to do the snap beans and all that so I guess they I guess that's what it is we will see we bought some celery sticks some avocado of course for my husband we bought some little potatoes which um, are gonna go great he said with these string beans we um, bought some blackberries also for my husband we bought some blueberries. I may eat a couple, but those are for my husband. And we bought my favorite, sweet cherries. So good. Um, this muscle milk is for my husband. We bought some of this microband to spray. And of course, my Texas Pete. We got two watermelons. We bought some Nestle water. We got some paper towel. Bananas, of course, my all time favorite fruit. We got some eggs. My husband got some raspberry lemonade for himself because raspberry is not a good thing for me. I just don't have like the aftertaste. We brought some mixed nuts, and I may eat a couple, I'm not a huge fan of it. And they also, um, Roast it with sea salt, so that should be good. We bought some tilapia, some catfish, skinless, and we found some chicken wings. Oh my goodness, I am all too happy. Now, I haven't bought the price, but I haven't had any in a while, so I'm gonna say it's worth it. So this is our little grocery, grocery haul. So this is what we have. And I'm going to wipe everything down, put it away, and get started on um, dinner, I think. So, you all have a great one. Talk to you soon.